Hi, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to budget better for your Facebook ads. I see lots of martial arts school owners trying to spend like £30 a day, £40 a day at the start of the month, and then 10 days in realizing they haven't got any budget left to keep spending on advertising. I'm going to show you how easy it is to spend the right amount of money so you can split it across the entire month. Now, if you don't know who I am, my name's Donovan. I help martial arts schools add more members to their classes. It's my sole mission to make it easy for martial arts schools to grow. And I don't mean through paid tactics. I literally mean through these videos. Like these videos are to help you as a martial arts school owner add more members to your classes completely for free. I don't want any money off of you. Now, what I will say though is for my mission to come true, I need to reach more martial arts school owners. And if you own a martial arts school, chances are you know a lot of martial arts school owners. So if you could just share this video to your page, if you find it useful in some way, share it to your page, maybe send it directly to someone who owns a martial arts school who you think it would help, then that would mean a lot and it would take me closer to my mission. Awesome, let's get straight into the video. Hey, so this is probably going to be one of the shortest videos I have ever done because it's very, very simple. So as a martial arts school owner, chances are you have a budget. Now, even if your budget is £300 or even if your budget is a million pounds or even if your budget is £10,000 a month, chances are the money that you have in your life is an infinite. You don't have an infinite amount of money and that is absolutely fine. Now, when you are spending money on Facebook ads, you need to spend an amount of money that you are comfortable with spending. And what I mean by that is across a month, what's an amount of money that you could spend and still feel comfortable even if you didn't get a single member from that amount of money? That's a question I want you to ask yourself. Now, some people might be able to spend a thousand pounds and if they didn't get too many members from that, it wouldn't change their life. Now, what I don't want you to do is try and spend a thousand pounds like the other martial arts schools out there and then not have any dinner at home. Like, let's not do that. <laughs> let's not do that. So as a martial arts school owner, if you're a small one-man band, you could probably spend maybe, let's say, 200 pounds, maybe 300 pounds per month. Whatever the number is, is completely down to you, but I want you to have that number in your head. What could you spend across a one-month period of time and not feel stressed about spending? Have you got a number in your head? Cool. Now I'm going to show you exactly how to budget for Facebook ads. So what a lot of martial arts schools do is they look at their friends and they see how much their friends are spending. Or I was speaking to someone the other day and what he was doing was he was thinking, well, in my area, my area is quite tough. And for every £10 I spend, I'm getting a lead. I want to get at least one lead per day. No, sorry. I want to get at least three leads per day. So I'm going to spend £30 per day. Now, if he spends £30 per day, that's £900 per month that he would be spending. Did he have £900 per month to spend? I don't know, but chances are £900 per month when you're just getting into Facebook ads probably is a lot of money for you to spend. And I don't want you to feel uncomfortable with spending and trying to get a return on Facebook advertising. So what I want you to do is I want you to think about a number that wouldn't bother you too much if at the end of the month you hadn't had much to show for it. And then once you get more comfortable with Facebook ads, of course you can scale it up because you'll learn which sort of ads are working in your area. So what I want you to do is I want you to go onto Google or go onto the calculator on your phone, take the number that you could spend without it bothering you too much. So I'm gonna imagine that this martial arts school can spend 300 pounds per month without it affecting his life too much. And then we're gonna divide that number by 30. And that gives us 10 pound. So we now know that we can spend 10 pound per day to spend 300 pounds per month. We want to spend that money every single day. So we wanna spend 10 pound every single day for the whole month. And then going on to the next month, we could continue spending 10 pound per day. And every single month we would spend 300 pounds per month on Facebook advertising. What a lot of martial arts schools do is they'll think to themselves, I could spend like 300 pounds. Day one, they'd spend 10 pound. Day two, they'd get excited because they started getting loads of leads and then they'd put it up and they'd spend 30 pound. Then the next day, they'd get excited again, they'd up it again and spend 40 pound. And then all of a sudden they look at their bank and they are overspending on their marketing and they don't have any money left for the last 20 days. I don't want you to be in that position. 
So whether your ads do incredible, whether your ads do awful, I encourage you to figure out a number that you'd be happy to spend per day and just stick to that number. So as I said, £300 per month, if we wanted to spend £300 per month, we divide that by 30. As you can see, we could spend £10 per day on Facebook advertising. Now, bearing that in mind, when we go onto the Facebook ads account now and we create our Facebook ads, what I want you to do is in the budget section, literally say, I want to spend £10 per day. Or if you were going to launch two campaigns, split that budget in half and spend £5 on each of those campaigns. When spending money on Facebook ads, you need to have an equal distribution across the month. And the reason why you need to do that is because if you overspend at the start of the month and then the end of the month, the results would have started getting better, you've missed out on that entire chunk of period that you're not advertising. So please split your budget, work out what you can spend per day comfortably across the month and just stick to that. And then I promise you, you'll probably start to get better results on Facebook than when you were like splurging money away at the start and then having to stop advertising because you couldn't afford it. I hope that makes sense. This was a really quick video. For some of you, that might be really basic information. I don't want to like teach you how to suck eggs, but I know this is something that some people struggle with as far as budgeting. It's just about splitting down the money. How much could I spend across a month period? Splitting that down to a daily spend and just spending that and sticking to that every single day. Awesome. That's everything for this video. I hope it serves you well. I know it's a bit of a simple one. It's just talking about budgeting. But to some of you guys, that might actually help you when it comes to Facebook advertising. I see too many martial arts schools overspending at the start of the month and then not being able to afford the rest of the month. Split your money down, figure out how much you can spend per day and then strictly stick to that. That's everything for this video. What I will say, as I said, it's my mission to help more martial arts schools grow their classes. I want to do it completely for free through this YouTube channel. So if you found this YouTube video in helpful in any way, shape or form, please share the video or share the channel to one of your friends who also owns a martial arts school or share it onto your feed, share it wherever you want to share it. And the more martial arts schools I can help, the closer I am to my mission. Thank you for watching. I hope it's helped. Have an incredible day. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video.